Hello and welcome to my review of Emily from Backman. Emily from Backman is a remarkable model of very high quality build for a very low price. I purchased this model for £45 which is very good price considering the build quality of the model. The build quality in particular is very high. All of the little details are there as you can see on the pistons, the wheels and the overall proportions of the train. As for the proportions, they are spot on. It retains the wheel arrangement and scale of the original Sterling single that she is based on. It also retains the colour of the original TV series and the new CGI version. However, there is a small problem with, with the colour and that is that the buffers at the front are the colour of the new CGI series. They used to be brass coloured in the old older series and I believe the book. That is one disappointment. Um, but the wheels are very high, high quality and what's interesting here is that the larger driving wheels turn much more slowly than, than the other smaller wheels which is very pleasing to look at. Interestingly Emily has four driving wheels. The large driving wheels here and the small driving wheels here which means that she's actually a very strong engine for her size and has the power to pull many, many coaches. But we'll get into that a little bit later in our running test. As for the funnel and the boiler and the whistle, they are the correct colour and size. So that really adds to the model. There is a disappointment, however, to Backman Emily, and that is the cab. The cab almost non-existent. There's this kind of blob surrounding the cab and filling the whole cab in which looks completely unrealistic and is really out of place on a model of this quality. Say if you were pulling a train, if you're pulling a train along and you see this, it really detracts away from the size of the model and the quality. Now Emily does come with a tender in the price and as you can see, the tender fits back memory in a perfect scale and style. The tender, just like the rest of back memory, has fully spoked wheels, the um, olive green colour, and very high quality coal, which is which looks very very really realistic. But the buffers again have the same um, silver colour, not the bronze colour. So that was the review of the aesthetics and appearance of Emily. But how does she actually run? Let's find out. Backman Emily has a clever eye mechanism which moves the eyes from left to right when the wheels are turning. One problem with Backman Emily is her slow speed performance. She really struggles to move at a slow speed, as shown here in this clip. This is how fast Backman Emily can move at full chat. Whilst Backman Emily has extra drive wheels, 
the lightness of the model still makes it struggle pulling along the loads. In conclusion, Backman Emily is a very, very good value model of very high detail. Thank you for watching. See you for our next review.